Welcome. In front of me is a ZTE Blade A31, and today I will show you how you can go through the setup process of this phone. So, when you put it up for the first time, you should be presented with this screen right over here, and all you would do is find your desired language from the list right here. Now, for me, it's already using correct one, so I'm just gonna get started, which will take me to the uh, connect to mobile network. Uh, this simply implies to insert a SIM card. So you can then use mobile network to, for instance, connect to your Google account throughout the setup process. Now, if you choose to skip this step, and as an example, also a Wi-Fi connection, you will not see the Google login page throughout the setup process. And additionally, date and time will not be set automatically. So here's the Wi-Fi, which I'm gonna set up offline. Now, right here we have some Google services, so we have location, scanning, and sending user and diagnostic data. To quickly go over them, uh, location is just GPS tracking for uh, applications like Google Maps, so it can give you a correct route to your destination using your exact position on the map. Then we have allow scanning, which allows the device to look for signals like Wi-Fi and Bluetooth, and below that we have send user and diagnostic data, which allows Google to gather data on you and send it to themselves. I'm actually gonna disable that, it seems a little bit creepy. And on the next page, the phone automatically uh, prompts us to set up a pin for digit one. You can change it to be something else like a pattern or password if you want to, or you can just skip it if you don't want to set anything up. You have some privacy policy, so you can read what you're agreeing uh, to right here. You can obviously tap on the blue text to get a uh, longer version of this. And from there, select agree. And right here we have option for system navigation. Now surprisingly, we have actually gesture navigation if that is something that you would like to use. I'll go with gestures, that's kind of what I prefer. And there we go, as you can see now the phone is set up. So if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.